What's going on, you two? Welcome back to the channel, Castro's Cakes. Once again, appreciate y'all for stopping in and checking out the channel as always. So, today on Sneakers, we actually got some information about the Air Jordan 3 Reimagined White Cement that is set to drop next Saturday, March 11th. So, uh, we've already had a shock drop on this shoe, which happened, I believe, like a week or two ago. I tried to enter on the shock drop, had no luck at all. Actually, I think that shock drop was last, like, Thursday or Friday, but like I mentioned, I had no luck on the shock drop. If you're able to cop on the shock drop for the Air Jordan 3 White Cement Reimagined, let me know in the comments and let me know if you got the shoe in hand yet, and let me know how you feel about the shoe if you've seen it in hand already. I've done a review on that shoe already, and that shoe looks really nice in person, so of course I will be adding it to my list of shoes to cop. Now, continuing on to the information we got today uh, from the Sneakers app. Now, Sneakers will be doing an exclusive access on the Air Jordan 3 White Cement Reimagined, and that will be on March 2nd. Now, like I mentioned, the release date for these is March 11th. But if you hit on the exclusive access, you should have your pair before the actual release date on the Sneakers app. Now, uh, along with letting us know that there will be exclusive access on the, the these Jordan 3s, uh, they also gave us some information about how the exclusive access will work and then what criteria they're using to actually select who gets exclusive access. And I feel like... This criteria is very interesting in the first place, and I feel like a lot of people will, will feel some type of way about it just because, depending on when you join sneakers, it, it may have an impact on if you actually get exclusive access. Now, for me, I never get exclusive access, so I'm already just going to go with the feeling that I'm not going to get exclusive access for these at all. It'll just have to be a wait and see, but let's go ahead and jump into it. So on the sneakers like when you go into sneakers and go to the feed tab it does have a section that says launch details air Jordan 3 white cement reimagine and you can click that and then it will take you to like two paragraphs of information and that's what i'm going to go through so uh, it says air Jordan 3 white cement reimagine and then it has launch details and it says the aj3 white cement reimagine honors 35 years with an aged aesthetic that redefines timeless Bring the vintage vibes with yellowing on the midsole, eyelids, and back tab, plus classic Nike Air branding at the heel. Elephant print updated to replicate the 88 original, and splashes of sail and fire red keep the original design alive and well. So, that's just a little bit of background about the shoe. Uh, now, continuing on, it says to, prior to prioritize sneakers members who have been after the White Cement AJ3 in North America, the Air Jordan 3 White Cement Reimagined will be uh, released via exclusive access in the sneakers app. This will be in addition to the main launch on March 11th. So this is specific to those in North America. Um, so like the UK and all that. I don't know if y'all will get something different overseas. But this drop is like I mentioned specific for North America. And it is in addition. So we will still get the regular launch on March 11th. But this will just be in addition to that. Uh, now considering on to the next section that they had. Uh, this is understanding exclusive access for the Air Jordan 3 White Cement Reimagined. And this section is where things are going to get a little interesting for those of you that are interested in potentially getting exclusive access. So, it says exclusive access will provide some of, the, some of our most dedicated sneaker members in North America the opportunity to purchase the Air Jordan 3 White Cement Reimagined. The offer will only go out to members who have entered and lost both the AJ3 Free Throw Line from 2018 and the AJ3 White Cement Shock Drop last week on sneakers however not every member who meets this criteria will necessarily be selected and then the last paragraph says exclusive access does not guarantee general availability or availability in your preferred size for a greater opportunity to secure a pair in your size it is recommended that you have push notifications enabled so you know if you are given exclusive access exclusive access will be sent out to select members on march 2nd which is this upcoming thursday so and that first section, which is where we're going to jump back to, and like I mentioned at the beginning of the video, the specific criteria that they had for you to receive exclusive access for the shoot. Um, so I will go back over and read it again. The offer will only go out to members who have entered and lost both the AJ3 free throw line from 2018 and the AJ3 white cement shock drop last week on sneakers. So that will be very interesting for a lot of people because one, some people like recently joined sneakers in the past year or two so some people just don't have sneakers history all the way back to 2018 i actually think 2018 was the year that i hopped on the sneakers app so i don't even think i entered for the aj3 free throw line back when those dropped i didn't even like threes like that back then so i more than likely like 95 percent sure did not enter for that release when it happened um and then of course for the aj3 white cement shock drop that happened last week i tried for it 
had no luck so I, I don't know if that counts as an L or how exactly that works but I've seen like people talking on Twitter like does sneakers really have or does Nike really have your history from your sneakers account back to 2018 or how exactly does that work and I, my only guess would be like because you have like all of the shoes that you've copped on your account so maybe they have some type of algorithm that can read where you purchased something back in 2018 on the sneakers app and that's how they're able to tell or how exactly that will work but yeah I'm, I'm curious to see how this will go like I mentioned a lot of people are gonna feel like this is unfair because one you like I mentioned earlier you might have not had a sneakers account back in 2018 so you never even got the opportunity to, to enter for the Air Jordan 3 free throw line and you just didn't get hit on the shock drop either so it's just a lot that goes into this I'm not exactly sure why Nike decided to go all the way back to 2018 for the Air Jordan 3 free throw line. Maybe there's some significance tied into this shoe. I have no idea. I didn't really do any research and I just read this and was like, that's weird. But, you know, it is what it is. I understand. But let me know how y'all feel about that criteria to be able to or to potentially be able to get uh, the exclusive access on the sneakers. And now, like I mentioned, I never get exclusive access. So when I read it, I was like, whatever like I just I don't get exclusive access anyway so it's not really that big of a deal to me but for those of y'all that do get exclusive access I'm sure y'all will feel not all of you but some of you will feel some type of way about this just because the criteria is on it's weird it's a weird criteria to be honest going back to 2018 is just it's different if we're telling the truth so um, that is their criteria for the shoe and then of course just the next sentence was um, however not every member who meets this criteria will necessarily be selected so of course that's normal when it comes to exclusive access. Even though you get exclusive access, it does not guarantee that you will be able to get the shoe on exclusive access. Basically, they just send it out to everybody and it's almost first come, first serve until they sell out. So, it'll be interesting to see what happens on Thursday for exclusive access. It seems like there are, are a lot of pairs of these Air Jordan 3 White Summit Reimagined. I've heard there are a lot of pairs. I've seen like different stock numbers going around. But to have a shock drop, we're going to have an exclusive access and then to have the main drop as well. It seems like there's going to be or, or there are a pretty good amount of these Air Jordan 3s that are set to drop. So hopefully, hopefully there are still a pretty decent amount come release day. But we're just going to have to wait and see uh, for March 11 to roll around. But once again, let me know how y'all feel about the criteria for this exclusive access. Do you feel it's fair? Do you like it? Let me know kind of what your thought is on it. And then also, like, if you had a sneakers account back in 2018, did you actually enter for the Air Jordan 3 free throw line? And then did you take the L in the shock job last week? Like, I'm just curious to see how many people will actually, like, have history back that far and did enter for that show at the same time. But that is everything I have for this video. Go and subscribe to the channel. Hit that like button on all the notifications. So you can stay today when I post new content. Hopefully, y'all have a great rest of the week. Stay safe and stay blessed. And I'll catch y'all in the next video.